Welcome to Voice Bootcamp, a global name in unified communication. In this chapter, we'll focus on voice gateways. Now, give you, uh, just to give you a uh, uh, warning that we're not going to be talking about the entire voice gateways here because we already have talked about uh, voice gateways in iOS level in very detail in Chapter 4 of Module 1. So if you have not already uh, viewed that video, I would strongly suggest that you, video, you watch that video first module 1 chapter 4 and then come back to this one because this is going to only show you the call manager perspective of it in unified communication gateway you have four type of protocols that are used for signaling purposes or acting as a gateway uh, protocol between the router and the call manager the type of protocols we have is H.323, MGCP, SIP and Skinny H.323 is a peer-to-peer which is very complex configuration and allows you to maintain a separate dial plan on the call manager as well as in call, uh, router. MGCP is a client server simplified centralized administration because all the dial plan and call controls happens from the call manager perspective. SIP is developed by IETF, very simple protocol, ASCII based, faster, uh, designed for multimedia over, over IP, works in a client server as well as peer to peer. SIP use request and response to establish a call, maintain and terminate or known as session. Skinny Cisco proprietary protocol is a client server because it requires a server call manager, IPA phone is a client and simplify the configuration in which call manager maintains a dial plan and a route pattern. H2, H323 gateway is a peer to peer protocol. When you register Cisco router as an H223 gateway to call manager all the PSTN signals will terminate on the router itself and then from here it's going to go over the IP to call manager. So the VoIP IP side of it is use H.225 and H.245. H.225 is the call setup protocol that contains the call setup such as ringing, ringback, so and so alerting. H.245 is your um, code capability negotiation. Both of these protocols use TCP port 1720 to communicate. Once the call has been established, the media traffic or RTP traffic is over UDP between the uh, gateway and the phone itself. When you register this router to the call manager as an H3 gateway, the gateway status in call manager will always be unknown. So, to add a gateway, Go to Device menu, add a gateway, select H.323 gateway, 